Hi everyone, Michelle Markey with Medina Domestic Art Studio, and this is a quick video on what I've got going on here with the background of this rose. Um, I have got classes coming up here shortly. Uh, this rose, which is, by the way, a DTF, um, it will also include painting the background, so I thought I would come in and paint this little sucker. Now note, hopefully you can tell this, that this has already been turned into a little mini quilt. And if I zoom in here, you can see that it's already been quilted. And in fact, there is it on the back. Um, you can tell it is a little mini quilt. I think I used 80-20 in the center. Now what I'm doing here is I am applying a pale pink tinted fabric medium. I made this using the Purely Pigments Sunkissed Pink. I think there's literally about 32 drops in this bottle. And uh, the bottle I believe is eight ounces. So you can see um, how concentrate that, that becomes when you mix it in with the fabric medium. So this is just to show you um, a quick and easy way if you would like to get your backgrounds painted. I'm just coming in here and applying it directly on this corner. Uh, not really being careful, although the carefulness comes in making sure you don't get too much going down into the quilting because it will leak to the back side and then you'll get blotches. And if you're going to be making this into a show quilt, they will discount you for that. Um, ask me how I know. Um, so as you can see, I'm just about done. The next step is going to be to allow this to dry. Yeah, and even look at that. I'm going directly over the DTF. Boy, I, I gotta say how much I love these DTFs. They're, they're turning out to be quite um, a godsend when it comes to creating fast and easy kits without having to embroider them. So there you have it. I'll finish up this little bit. Uh, if you're coming to one of my shows in the near future, I will have this uh, available as a kit, as well as uh, being able to see the actual quilt itself. As always, thanks for watching.